It is uh, 4.07 a.m. Saturday. Uh, just got to the Appleton Airport after waking up to my flight, my original flight, changing and getting in later and missing my connection. I had to scramble at 3.30 in the morning, change my flight to now get into Hartford, Connecticut at 1 p.m. for a 2 p.m. signing at the Zombie Hideout in Springfield, Massachusetts. So, our day's starting. Our day's starting off hot, but it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a real good day. Signing at the Zombie Hideout with Smart Mark Sterling and Ethan Page. And then, uh, head right over to Blitzkrieg Wrestling. My pal Jeremy Leary, uh, myself, Smart Mark, Ethan Page, all on that show, along with Max Caster, BSK, a ton of others. Uh, it is gonna, it's like a, it's a stacked, stacked card. I'm teaming with Dan Barry, which is just gonna be a blast. So, I'm excited. Today's a good day. Fresh off vacation. Straight to work. I love it, though. Here we go. All right, here we are. We made it almost an hour late after delays and then just waiting on baggage. But it's 2.03. I was supposed to start signing at two o'clock at Zombie Hideout. We're gonna hustle, we're gonna make it. I'm gonna see Mark and Julian. I guarantee they're gonna give me a hard time for being late. But we're here, let's go. Hi, guy. Oh, my God. We can start, guys. Star's here. Everyone, give Dylan a round of applause for showing up. Thank you, work. guys. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Three planes and a canoe. Private flight just landed. I'm just a teenager. Egg, baby. All right. What do we got? All right. No one wants like the beast ones or lost you. Like, just give me the normals. It's all well, anyone wants. When the ninja ones come out, have you seen those? Oh, ones? I knew you'd want those. I can't wait. I'm a movie guy. I love the movie. Yeah, you don't have a brain. I don't have a shot. Oh, there's the EW figure. Got a boss, man. These are random. I'm so glad Landon's not here. There's so many Funkos. And he would buy all of them. Disney World, that would be mine. Can't do Disneyland. Oh. You ain't getting it, man. Ooh, I've never seen those. That's pretty awesome. Oh no. Oh no. Joe shoes. Landon, when you see this, none of these were on sale. I couldn't buy any of these for you. None of them were on sale. Husfar! What's up, man? Nice shirt. Thank you. What's up, man? Just got here. Just got in? A little traffic, but made it. Yeah, we, I, uh, my flight was delayed too, so oh, I got here about 2.30. I'm hoping for ACW. I don't have to deal with any, uh, any of this. There's going to be no traffic. <laughs> no traffic in Oshkosh. Yeah, thank God. Just walls and walls of turtles. 
Super 7s. Mechas. Whoa, the, I haven't seen these yet. Those are awesome. Landon just called. Looks like I'm getting this. It's a good one though. I'll, I'll approve of this. We love chili, Kevin. So as I'm looking around here, I notice the one thing I do need. All three Brooke Hogan CDs signed. Oh, that's if I can get him to personalize it to the greatest level. That would be cool. Peter Dinklage. I don't know if you noticed, but we're wrestling inside of a mall. Yeah, it's also like kind of like dilapidated and empty. And this is a, actually a CVS that is officially closed, clearly. Oh, you don't say. <laughs> no, nah, it's not. Uh, also get a staph infection from this chair. You're yeah. Diva now. I yes, don't I am. like it. Like correct. This is no Marriott, Dylan. Rich Ethan is not my favorite Ethan. Like I like broke, angry Ethan. Because then it makes me feel Still better. Angry. It makes, me, watch it, just it makes me feel better about myself. <laughs> Shut up. And introducing his bad tea partner. So I don't know what we're doing. I, yeah, I'm trying to, to I'm trying to leave the venue. I don't want to watch him wrestle. And now he goes, Ugh. one last pick. Dill, Dill, can we get can we get a pick quick? Yeah. Well, He's asking me quick. for a photo. It's gonna cost him just a quick twenty. I don't know what. What are we doing? We're taking pictures. That's it. Let's do that. All we're, right. Speed. Yeah, I don't have a sweet shirt. Yeah, you're fine. You look the way you look. I look the way I look. I like podcasts. Big money tripod. Big money tripod. Using right that here. TNT money to get, me, get yourself a tripod there, huh? All right, here we go. All right, so what do we do? Oh, is this like the speedy thing? I did not close out the video diary from Blitzkrieg. And that was because I was going to continue with a recap when I got in this morning, back home, and give a little recap. Talk about today being Mother's Day. Nice chat about that. But I am now currently stuck in Detroit, not home for another two hours, at least. Please watch your step as you exit the moving walk. Thank you for saying please. Um, I was supposed to be home an hour and a half ago. And now we might not take off from Detroit for another two more hours. So. Happy Mother's Day. I'll keep you posted. Currently at Aurora Hospital. Just finished two hours straight of MRIs. Here's one of those, you think you know, but you have no idea moments. Um, still trying to figure out what's going on with my back. A lot of issues still with my legs and my feet. Yeah, 
two straight hours of MRIs. Had to do an hour and a half of regular with no contrast. Had to take me out. Had to give me contrast. Had to do a half hour of that. Um, I hope to God this, uh, this leads us to figure out what needs to happen. I'm in so much pain from laying down on that MRI bed. Um, and here's another thing. Whenever I have to give blood or have the contrast stuff or injections, that kind of thing, it's always a pain in the butt because uh, little people can't straighten their arms all the way. Um, so it's always like hit or miss, no pun intended. Uh, if they can get a vein, and this guy thought, oh yeah, I can get one for sure. Your, your arms are fine. Pricks me, nothing. Pricks me, nothing. Now the third time he puts the, the needle in to try to get a vein, he now leans. I, this is a complete accident, I get it. But he leans on the MRI machine and I start moving in back into the tube. And it's like, oh no, oh no, oh no. And I'm go. I'm just yelling. Oh shit! Finally, he stops it. Oh man, just it was a mess. It was an absolute mess. Ends up getting my hand, of course. That's what we always have to do. But then, like about an hour in, my back, my lower back, just started killing me, and I. I just couldn't, I couldn't not move. So if I messed, I told the guys, if I messed up the pictures, I'm sorry. If I ruined the whole process, but I couldn't lay still anymore. It's the most pain and back pain I've had in a long time. So here's to hoping, here's to hoping we figure things out. Also, sorry for not closing the video yesterday or even the Blitzkrieg one or the zombie hideout. I was just happy to get home and to be able to spend time with my mom and relax after a crap travel day. So I just, I literally rushed home and, uh, and did that. So thanks for putting up with me. Now the next time you see me might be on Saturday, leaving for CAP. Thanks guys. It is six something AM, Saturday, May 14th. We got our But as you can see, the vlog, the video diary continues. It continues. Today we're going to camp. Create a pro wrestling all the way in lovely New York City. Today, create a pro. Tomorrow, I fly from New York to Baltimore. For Baltimore Celeb Fest and home tomorrow night. This is gonna be a this is gonna be a fun video diary. Just combining last weekend and this weekend. Joey Avalon and Sierra are flying from Milwaukee out to New York. Joey Avalon, who is deathly deathly afraid to fly. First flight today ever. Then has to. Wrestle Max Caster in one of the biggest matches ever. It's gonna be fun. I'm really looking forward to today. Uh, myself, Smart Mark Sterling, challenging for the Creative Pro Tag Titles. Today's a good day. Today's gonna be a fun one. Get to see Hawkins. Have to see Matt. But here we go. <laughs> To be honest, I didn't know if it was Bruce Springsteen or You're Tom Petty. I have, I have no idea. Disgustingly. All We're, excited about Limp Biscuit over here. Real pumped. Limp Biscuit, eight days away. Oh, man. Uh, 
Uh, we're, we're here, we're at LaGuardia. <sighs> now we are headed to JFK, which is 12, 12 miles, mind you. Should be 15 minutes, maybe 30 minutes. I don't say we do it in 30. Huh? I think it's gonna be, those are rookie numbers. <laughs> gonna bump those numbers up, kid. Yeah. Welcome to New York, Wisconsin boy. I hate this place so much. Going to pick up Avalon and Sierra. Avalon is going to be shaking and or crying. Is he, yeah, is he handling it? I have no idea. Oh, man. I haven't gotten any updates. We'll see. Just picking up two blonde babes. Welcome to the big city. <laughs> Big city. How's the bright what's, what's the blood pressure in the heart? Um, that, I, I still can't deaf. hear. Oh, you're gonna get the. No, I've been trying for the last like 20 minutes. Really? I did it yeah. two seconds. How it did not go well? How did how did you do on takeoff and landing? Uh, takeoff, I got your video. Take, takeoff was fine. It was ish. Uh, d descent. I blacked out for half a second. <laughs> oh my god. Like just like just in and out. And I was right back. He but, was like Sarah, yeah. and I was like, what? He's like, Dylan's been blacking out on flights for years, but then. <laughs> That's not for capacity. <laughs> All right, I just found him. I'm glad you're alive. I made it. So, I completely forgot about this. What you know? I have something. Corey. Oh, yeah, here we go. Corey, close your eyes. Is it like the little wings for your first flight? <laughs> Corey, you gotta close your eyes. We went up to the front and got to talk to the captain. He shake his hand. Oh. Hold on, Corey. Whoa. <laughs> I'm kind of jealous on this one. So are you going to reach it to him like you have little arms? Arts and crafts with Landon. Oh, ECW, you said? Custom with jeans. And look at the left, look at the right leg, the left leg. He broke it? Yep. No. <laughs> it's pointed. Very much to the left. That's okay. evil, bro. <laughs> <laughs> back and haunt you, I think. Dave Wheeler. Thanks, pal. Oh, we are, man. I say Landon. Great job. Good old Dave. <laughs> so, first person at my table here at Creative Pro mentions going postal. And the first thing, first thing he says, Landon is a star in the main world. I hate it. Uh, what were the other ideas we had? Wrestling Superstar Swoggle. Uh, yes, it was. Hi. What's, uh... <laughs> hey, what's, as always, when I see you, give me the update. How's the attitude? Oh, terrible. Oh, Terrible. No. We've had a we've had a morning. Had a day? Done. We had our flight canceled, then delayed. He lost his bag. He was hungry, and we got stuck in New York traffic. So, so it was all your fault. Yeah, How much of it was your fault? Well, it wasn't my bag. I wasn't the pilot of the flight. He is hangry, Matt, and I cannot control the New York traffic. So let, let's think about that. But how much did he put on you? All of it, obviously. It's a classic. Classic. So, what's up? You're running around like a chicken with your head cut off. Today. Sucks. This is really show sucks. Welcome. I mean, welcome to the promoter life, bud. It's horrible. You know that's really horrible. Yeah, I'm wait, I can't wait for next week when you're miserable. <laughs> <laughs> not gonna be miserable at all. Oh yeah. You know, don't I'll be sitting back with a white claw watching, not giving a f about you. <laughs> well, you sold out today. Two sellouts from two buddies. There you go. This there we right go. Side, but man, this is so much goes into this nightmare. Yeah. Yeah. Fire alarm went off. But we're putting out fires, Brian. So, this piece of shit. Okay, why? Well, I, I did that at Rough and Rowdy. You did? And you fought very well in the main event? You, you treated me. I didn't treat you like anything. You, you were an me. asshole to me. I was not. You were. I was telling the honest to God truth. About what? About going into the fight 
about how, in all honesty, I had nothing to lose, and you just kept running me down and talking nope, down to no, me. No, that's not how I remember. When I got home, my wife looked at me and said, why did he treat you so shabbily? Why did you, didn't you roll out the red carpet for him? I said, yes, I gave him money and candy bars, and he still- What, so you gave me candy bars like a child, so you're saying you treated me like a child? Is that what you're saying? No, I said, I'm fat. I and I also, you did not give me money. I did not get paid by you. I got paid. You got paid by Barstool. Oh, I'm sorry. Are you? Oh, I'm sorry. Dave Portnoy. How you doing? What's that? What's that right there? What's I don't that? know what that is. Is that a big ass Barstool? Is that a big ass Barstool? Listen, I can go on Etsy too and make my own shit. I don't know what that Barstool is. On. I don't know what that is. I d you were against me and I hope they throw you out first and you land right on your head. I hope that happens. First of all, if I treated you poorly, yeah. I apologize. I'm not taking it. Be it's because of you that I lost. It's not because. No, you were gonna lose. I didn't even. I didn't hit so you, you one time. Hold on, hold on. I didn't hit you one time. You said so. I was going to lose no matter what you were about to say, right? What did I say? You just said you were gonna lose. At no, whatever happened happened. So you were against me. Yeah, I'm ready. Oh, they're calling me from. Okay. <laughs> Mind your way, guys. Right. Oh, Hotel Mint. Yes. Hotel Mint. Bye. <laughs> Love you. Love you. Thanks, bud. It's hey, where's that championship? Show it up. It's in the. Show it. It's in. It better be in your goddamn bag. It's back. in your back seat right now. No, it's not. Yeah. What am I supposed to do with it? It's yours. I don't travel with belts. You don't wear shit. You do like What am I going to do with this? Every champion ever created for us to travel their belt. Hey guys. What? Hotel Mint. Oh, it's great. What? Hotel. Thank God we're getting the short stay. Yeah, $60, three hours. <laughs> you set up as a... Uh, we're at a hooker hotel. Sure. <laughs> I haven't seen any actual hookers though, so like, I don't know if it's... But they're in the rooms. How long was that? I'll be at work right now. Three hours for $50. Yeah, we'll four hours for $60. Five hours for $100. And posted like in the lobby. Life is good. Life is very good. All right. 
currently connecting in Charlotte. Flew LaGuardia to Charlotte. Charlotte. Not flying to Baltimore. Baltimore Celeb Fest. It's a huge autograph signing that I like. Can't believe the lineup on it. Should be a really good time. Real fun day. I'm fly home tonight. It's even better. Just sleep in my own bed. Whenever I have the opportunity, and it's rare because <clears throat> because the Appleton Airport is so small, it is very rare to get a flight that gets home in late uh, late enough. So I don't have to fly home tomorrow morning. I just love being in my own bed, as we all do. It's a very common thing, I think. So yeah, I'm going to land at 11.30 a.m. and head straight to Baltimore Celeb Fest. My gear bag. It's so heavy because of this new gold. Should've. I should, still should have stuck in Hawkins' truck. All right, we're home. We're home. I don't know why. I don't know why this weekend felt so long, but it did. It uh, awesome weekend though. Really, really fun weekend. Create a pro on Saturday. Um, it, it, so much fun. It was it was such a fun fun match and show and experience. Uh, I was joking about it, but Avalon getting on his first flight uh, deathly afraid or not getting on his first flight and getting flown to New York a place that I'm sure he never thought he would ever go to um, it's probably gonna need to dark not like emotionally but lighting wise uh, but man just seeing him kill it with Max Caster and then Sierra belong, truly, truly belong uh, in the ring with Chelsea. I don't care. Chelsea and um, uh, Statlander. It was amazing. Absolutely amazing. A good weekend. Baltimore Celeb Fest today was so much fun. Uh, sorry I didn't get a lot, I, I don't ever get really footage of like the cons, especially when I'm on my own. I just feel awkward, not gonna lie. That's me being real, I, I just feel, uh, feel awkward filming sometimes. A lot of the time, I still feel awkward filming for the video diary, but I'm home. I have the Creative Pro tag team title in my bag. Landon has no idea I won it. I'm gonna surprise him. I'm gonna put it on his bed so when he gets home from school tomorrow, he sees it. He never gets like, I'm sure he, I mean, he's, he's proud of me and he's happy for me and everything I do, but like this being Hawkins' company's title will be the reason it's cool. So yeah, we have a big week ahead. I always end these on like a somber note, but again, it's a peek behind the curtain kind of thing. All of these are. This is now we're we're off to work. This is the biggest week of the year for myself, for my my partners in ACW, for the roster, for the fans. This is the biggest week of the year, and it's uh, it's gonna be a lot of work just really really hope everything goes together well it will it 
really, really well. I'm excited. I can't wait to film as much as I can from 83 Weeks Live to Wrestling Con setup to Day of Con to show to after party, all that. Limp Biscuit on Sunday. Yeah. Here we go. There's the, the counter for here we go. It's going to be a fun week.